here let us see the practical representation of capsule staining the requirements for capsule staining are a clean grease free glass light we require the culture bacterial culture capsulated bacterial culture inoculation loop bunsen burner we require the stains which is congo red and manivals stain a wash bottle and the staining rack the procedure is take a glass line and on the glass slide add one drop of congo red now to this add a loop full of the organism the bacterial culture before that mix the bacterial culture well and also sterilize the inoculation loop by incineration cool the loop dip the inoculation loop into the bacterial suspension and take the organism place it on the stain congo red which you have taken and mix the sample well gently mix the sample by holding your loop in the horizontal direction and evenly distribute this mixture throughout the slide that is the stain and the sample allow this slide to air dry after air drying now add the next stain which is the manival stain which contains ferric chloride which will fix the organism to the slide it contains phenol which increases the penetration power and acid fixin which makes the cell or which makes the uh, cell appears red and acetic acid which converts the entire medium to acidic add the manival stain and keep it for 10 minutes a uh, 3 minutes sorry allow this uh, stain to be there for 3 minutes after 3 minutes remove the excess stain drain out the excess stain do not wash the slide or do not rinse the slide remember we have not heat fixed the sample hence there are chances that organisms can get washed away hence do not heat fix i mean do not rinse remove the excess drain the excess and then allow it to air dry allow this smear to air dry once it is dried now observe it under the oil immersion objective where the cells will appear red the capsule around it will appear colorless and the entire background will appear blue